Hi, I'm Travis Sutcliffe and I'm a product specialist for J-Law Fabricating in Ontario, Canada. And we're here today at the Manure Expo 2017 in Arlington, Wisconsin. J-Law Fabricating has been well known and been in the business many years in the feed mixing business. So they've done small to large mixes on truck mounts. Um, been in that many many years, very well known for their square coat auger and some of the other patented features they have. I uh, got into the manure business about two years ago. Um, I was uh, brought in from another company uh, that developed the spreaders over about a 10 year period. We were looking to get into a larger company like JLO that had distribution throughout North America and even overseas. We have a uh, guillotine door operated by these vertical cylinders. Uh, what we're doing here is we're running the floor chain even with the door only partially open. We're pulling the material under the door, which is giving us a very even spread. So we're pulling a consistent six inches, one foot, two foot, whatever we're calibrating into the beaters. So we're getting a consistent feed of primarily compost materials, chicken manures, that kind of thing. Um, and then if we run a beef manure where we're doing higher rates, uh, then we remove the canopy and open the door. This is our uh, heavy duty logging chain that we use. Uh, lots of other machines use logging chains. We use the largest one available, which is a, uh, a three quarter inch grade 100. Um, so it's a very, very large, very hard wearing chain. Um, so it eliminates a lot of issues that we may have seen years ago in chain systems. The slats here are a loose mounted uh, slat that's basically just sitting on a, um, uh, an internal peg, basically. So if the slat ever gets majorly damaged, uh, it will actually bend and go out through the back of the machine and not pull the chain off the sprockets or, or do any other damage. The hydraulic cylinder here is pushing the axle backwards and forwards. We call it our hydraulic slide axle. It can be moved on the go, fully loaded. Um, so what we're doing there is we're changing the tongue weight on the tractor on the fly so we can move it back and forth about 18 20 inches um, and then depending on where the load is or how much weight you want to have on the tractor we can adjust it on the fly so we offer a real uh, large range of flotation tires um, on this series of manure spreader we go up to 26.5 diameter on the larger heavy duty spreaders we go up to 30.5 diameter tires uh, we stay with tandem axle because we believe uh, strongly that it's very simple uh, much more rugged and more reliable long term. We also now have a scale system, so the scale bar is mounted in the hitch here um, and that gives us uh, three different levels of scales available. And then the rear canopy. The rear canopy is something pretty unique to us. Uh, it took a lot of time to get to work the way we wanted it to do. It has an adjustable door inside and basically what's happening is we're bringing the manure into the beaters, we're forcing the manure to go up inside the canopy which is grinding the material so it can only fall down and hit the spinners when it's fully ground up. So you get rid of all your lumps. We just get a very controlled spread from this eight inch opening here and it spreads it more like a fertilizer spreader. Just recently this year, um, j Laura has now merged in with another company in Colorado and Nebraska, uh, previously known as MMI, uh, which is bringing on another um, type of manure spreader as well, which we don't have here today, but that is coming down the, down the line. Um, which is also bringing in horizontal feed mixes, truck mount mixes. So we're, we're expanding the product range of JLOR um, continuously and, and growing and, and bringing on new dealers and new distribution.